Well, Jonathan is atypical to a lot of students. You know, when he started the cookbook drive and when I saw it, I was just overwhelmed with the articles that had come in, the recipes that had come in, and to think that this child put this all together. Jonathan helps with the cancer walk, with the food drives for Echo, we do a coat drive. Jonathan is always involved in all these. No, we're just extremely proud of him, and we know he's going to do well. We heard about the um, Peru uh, mission trip in the, in the First Presbyterian Church. Uh, it was interesting, and it sounded like it needed some help, and then that's when we started the idea. Yes, it was much more fun than just asking people for money. It was more fun to like see the recipes and stuff. It felt like a cookbook was the best. Um, we got recipes from famous people, a lot of them, and we also have some recipes from some local people, and we have some recipes for from some people that make good food. I hope that it will go to Peru to help um, the church prosper and help and let it um, get better to help the people there. Most young people today are very um, lazy, I guess I could say. Um, but so they don't really take the time, but if everyone would do something even just very small, it would make a huge difference. Make, it depends on where you want, what field you want to be in. You could go from anywhere from um, just picking up trash around the neighborhood to um, giving donations to a food drive or some sort or doing a cookbook even. Um, when we got a letter from the former president Jimmy Carter, that thought, "Wow, someone that 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 was cool because a former president would do that." And I also like the like actually people responded. Not everyone responded, but most people did. And that was very very surprising. It, it, they just took time out of their very busy life to come and um, help by just sending a recipe. I just encourage um, ch children to do more. I'd also like to um, thank my family, my principal, Mrs. Parsons, um, my church, and the community for supporting me.